Hey everybody, it's Blue Totem. Welcome back to Super Mario RPG. So now that we're in Tadpole Pond, go to Rose Town now, Mar uh, Mello. Uh, luck be with you. So we know where we're going to next, but there's also a few things that we can do here while we're here, so might as well have to take a look at that. So if we go over to the left here, we have the uh, the Frog Coin Emporium. You're a first timer, aren't you? Listen up, the green coins you find periodically are, are frog coins. Accumulate them and you can buy items at Tadpole Pond. So we can buy some of these items here uh, for frog coins, which I don't think this is at all worth it for what they are because you need frog coins for other things, so. Uh, but the Sleepy Bomb puts enemies to sleep and probably does fair bit of damage as well, possibly. This way we can inflict statuses on our enemies though, so. But we can also use the bra uh, Bracer to raise an ally's defense in battle. I think it's only for that battle, possibly, unless it's just a permanent stat increase, which I don't... I don't think it is, probably. Uh, but there's also the uh, Energizer, raise ally's battle power during battle. Crystalline, raises party's defense in battle. And Power Blast, which raises party's attack power in battle. I never used any of these, so I don't think it's really worth buying them, so... Just finding them out in the world is just... You wouldn't even use them anyway, so... But we also have the Juice Bar here. Are you a card member? Even Toad, Toad of Sky has a membership card... Um, a membership here. Sorry, you're limited to this menu if you don't have a current membership card. So this is another shop, but it's just a normal shop, so you can use uh, regular coins for it. But here we can buy Froggy Drink. Which means that we can use it to recover the whole party by 30 HP each. So that's actually a really good item to have. We might even buy a few since we've got coins to spend. Uh, but anyway, let's also take a look around on the right side of this area. Because there's some good stuff for us to do as well. Uh, so let's talk to this tadpole here. I've got this dream of becoming a composer. I want to be as famous as Toad of Sky. My favorite song. It's Frog Fuchsia's Suite, number no, uh, 18. So la mi re do re do re. Toad of Sky is fond of it too. We need to actually have this written down basically so we know what we're doing. But basically, when we go to Melody Bay, play notes by jumping on the tadpoles. Let's hear your melody. So basically, whenever we jump on a tadpole in a different position, it will stay there for the rest of that position, or the rest of the time writing the song, basically. There are all the notes that we need to use. We have to jump whenever the tadpole is in the position we want it. And at the end, it plays the notes. But if we don't get the notes in the correct position, the tadpoles will go away. Is that something you composed? That sort of resembles the melody I'm thinking of. But of course, we didn't get it quite right, so... There's also a save block here if we need it. Not that I think we will, but we might want it afterwards once we're done. But anyway, let's do this now with... Starting with this so. La. Oh, I missed the third one, but it's okay. I have a graph on here to show me which ones to jump for. Oh, I missed it. It's wrong. It's all wrong. I have to... I'm just going to skip ahead because I know it's wrong. I have to restart now. Ah... <sighs> Because it's meant to be so la, mi, re, do, re, do, re. I'm pretty sure so. I actually didn't update this particular graph on my notes, which I probably should have. Because in the, uh, yeah. Because there's, there's future songs of this that we also need to do later on. Uh, but I, for those ones, I actually basically whited out the notes I didn't need to play. I think I'm doing this correctly, hopefully. I didn't check the specific positions of everything, but I think that's right. There we go. That's it. This is, this is the melody I've been looking for. Thank you for the inspiration. Please take this as a token of my gratitude. And we received an alto card. If I ever need help with my compositions again, I'll look for you here. Until then, adieu. 
So there we go, that's uh, the first song with a tadpole, so. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and save now. The Alto card gains access to the juice bar, or the expansion of the juice bar, where we can buy uh, some elixir, which is basically froggy drink, but better. So, we won't need this now probably, but it'll be, it's, it's good that we can come here to buy it whenever we need to. Ah, an Alto card holder. What would you like? So, we can buy an elixir, which recovers the party by 80 HP for 42 coins. That is really just probably unnecessary, but I'm going to buy one anyway so I can have it for later. Uh, but anyway, that should be everything in Tadpole Pond for the moment, so let's leave. But yeah, we probably don't need those right away. Uh, but anyway, Rose Way. Let's get started. You can't jump on or... Uh, or off when the block is blue. Try jumping when the block turns yellow. Okay, so we can't get off of these platforms when they're blue. Uh, but basically we can just stay on the platforms to move around between these areas. Uh, there are some enemies here that we could fight, but I can't... I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to go. I think... I think I just probably want to actually go to all the exits. Let's go. Oh, enemy. Cool. I don't think I ever fought one of these the first time through, but also we have the knock-knock shell now, I'm pretty sure. As Mario's weapon, and also the froggy stick, which works kind of like a hammer. So we have some new weapons to try out, so... They have an interesting attack pattern. I need to dodge later on in their attack, I think. That's the thing that you realize as you get further into the game, is you can... You have to block a lot later than you think you do. But anyway, let's keep taking these out. Very nice. Nope. Okay. The knock knock shell is very quick. But anyway, that's that fight done. Uh, I think I want to go over this way to start off, which is interesting because we have these f swinging platforms here. Uh, if we get in the way of the floating platforms, though, they will actually stop moving because they're stuck on you. Which will get them out of sync with each other, which is weird. Because you need them to be basically in sync so you can actually use them properly. Oh dear. That's fine. I'm just bad at blocking, apparently. Even though I've played this game for a, a long amount of time, because you need to play it for a long amount of time. Uh, but anyway, let me see if I can actually get this to work now. And that's fight another shy guy, apparently. Also, I just realized you can actually see what weapon you have when you're selecting which enemy to attack, so... Because it actually says down there that... <laughs> that that enemy's called a Star Slap, that's amazing. It also says underneath that, though, that I'm using a Froggy Stick. That's actually quite helpful. But anyway, once again, so let's take out that Shy Guy. I like the battle system in this game. It's really good. <laughs> I mean, it's very limited by what... what generation it's on. In terms of like hardware, software, and all that, but it's it's really it's really I, I something about it clicks. But anyway, let's oh I missed, and the only way to get onto the second one is to jump from the first one. Oh, it's slightly it's slightly more up to the right. That's fine. Okay. Nope, I'm bad at this. There we go, frog coin. Okay, it's hard to get to, but it's if it's worth it for a frog coin. But anyway, let's head back over this way and keep moving. I think we want to activate that again so we can go over this way. We can also try and get that coin if I play my cards right. There we go. But we also need to go to the second exit, so... I'm pretty sure the second exit is where we need to go. Yeah. Okay, so let's fight some of these enemies here. Oh, they're just running. Okay, let me take you out. Drops a big coin, that's good. Doom Reverb! Oh dear. I'm, uh, I'm assuming this is gonna affect her status. If it can. Oh, Murray's muted, okay, so we can't use... Uh, special. That's okay. He just looks so sad, though. 
all the characters look sad when they're muted. But anyway, um, do I want to fight you? I guess I will. Also, we have here a Snapdragon that we probably want to take out because that's a little bit tougher than the Shy Guys, so. Also, I should have used, I should have used Thunder, but it's okay. We can, we can save our S, uh, uh, FP a little bit more. Doom Reverb again. It'd probably be good to give, like, a, a, it'd be good to not have Mallow get muted because he, he's more primarily use, uses, um, FP for his, or see his specials for some stuff later on. So if we can avoid getting him muted later on, that'd be good. Or even now, I don't know. But there we go, get a mushroom. Oh, he just spawns in another one. Okay then. I don't even need to fight all these enemies, but I might as well. Oh, there he goes. Okay, very nice. And let's use Thunderbolt. Hopefully that's actually going to do something, because some enemies might, might be resistant to it. That didn't do a ton, but that's okay. I might attack the other one, so it evens out. And then let's use Thunderbolt again. again. Let me actually time it correctly this time, because I didn't last time. Nope, never mind. But it still worked out, so... That's what I was trying to do, but anyway. <laughs> I know what I'm trying to do. I'm just not good at doing it. Uh, anyway. We're still back- we're back in the other area now. I think I probably could have got that coin... Unless it- Hang on. Hang on, no, go back. Nope, go back. Go back. Because this is the same area as before, but I think we can only access this... Uh, other area. If we, uh... Go through the second path. Can I please get that coin? Thank you. Is there anything I missed? I don't think there is, actually. Also, this is weird, the way that this all links together. Once you get further in. Uh, but anyway. Let's keep going if I can. Okay. And third exit. Okay, Shy Guy on a block. There's a lot of Shy Guys on the blocks. Uh, but I think these are also coin blocks, so if I can actually keep hitting them, that'd be good, because then I can get more coins. Oh, wow. I don't think I ever saw this enemy. Arachne. I think- I think that's- I think that's how to- <laughs> I hope I'm right about that name. Let me take it out, since it's a fairly strong-looking enemy. Although it looks can be deceiving, I guess, but still. Defense up, very nice. Get some extra defense for Mallow, just for a bit. At the very least. I'm pretty sure those effects only last for the battle. Okay. And that was gonna run, so that's fine. We don't get any rewards from it running away, though. So, we only get rewards from things if we actually defeat them properly. Mushroom? Okay. Yeah, one of the- one of the- one, the north block is a mushroom. That's- that, that's why I put in my notes. Ah, uh, but anyway, let's keep going. And also I healed, apparently. I wonder if that's because of the mushroom. Is that how it works? Am I crazy? Is there other things in this game that I just never noticed? Quite possibly. Attack up, very nice. Attack up is a very good thing to have. Not that we can really get it reliably. But anyway, let's go get some more coin blocks, since the rest of these are coin blocks. Although I think I'm gonna try and fight- I'm gonna fight this enemy before it distracts me from coins. Okay, nice. Let me do the Thunderbolt correctly. There we go. It only did three extra hits of damage, but that's still better than nothing. Go to view. How do you- how are you still alive? You apparently had more health than the other one. Pollen nap. It's gonna put Mario to sleep. That's not good. Or at least make him drowsy. But that's okay. Because Mallow can still use his regular attack and win this for us, so. Okay, coins. Very nice. There's a lot of enemies here that just want to fight. 
apparently. I mean, that's how the whole game goes, but, you know. I'm not gonna turn down a fight. Very nice. Slowly getting more XP. Okay, there's more enemies and more coin blocks. There are four coin blocks here, so... Wow! All the enemies just running away. That'll make things easier. Let's take you out. Nice. One XP, one coin. I'm gonna grab all this then. Very nice. Okay, so let's do this. And then I'm gonna use Thunderbolt. Just so I can hit both enemies. Very nice. And he missed. Cool. Easy. Also, we could use Mallow's Psychic to see how much health the opponents have as well. Uh, but we should be alright. So. I think I'm also going to hit you. Then I might also use Thunderbolt again. Just because I can spend some FP. I don't need to be too reserved with my FP usage. We'll be alright, but anyway. Alright people, form ranks. Attention! Shelled warriors. Hooded sorcerers. And last but not least, Grounding Goombas. This is our finest moment. The Koopa Troop is invincible. We shall be victorious. The bridge is down, but we'll find a way to get back in. Move out on the double. I love the interaction that Bowser has with his troops. Bowser and his troops must be on their way to Bowser's Keep. Come on, Rose Town is just up ahead. It is just up ahead, so that's pretty good. Okay, so, Rose Town, let's go. And this this toad just got hit by an arrow of some kind. See, arrows come fly, flying out from the forest, and when you're, you're hit, you can't move. See? Look. I can't move a muscle. Now I know how a scarecrow feels. Ah, uh, well, you can still talk, apparently, which is good. Uh, but let me go down this way. Talk to you, if I can, maybe. Oh, there's actually a couple of toads in here. I tell you, it's scary out there. Or out here. But someone's got to pump the water. I'm worried about my grandson. He went to play, but didn't come back when he should have. Grandpa's pumping some water for us. I wish I could help, too. We're told not to go outside, because it's too dangerous. Okay. So they're just pumping the water here. Can I talk to you while you're out here? Oh, that's why you said it's scary out here, not out there. Okay, because you're supposed to say that out here, but anyway. Oh, here's one of the grandsons, I guess. I want to go someplace fun. Standing around here is so boring. Oh no, this is not good. Now I can't go to the forest to chop any up any wood. Uh, but anyway, let's go into the shop over here. Uh, except I think I want to actually go up here and, if I can, enter from the chimney to get this block up here with a flower in it. Very nice. Uh, but I believe there's also a an, an hidden vis invisible block here with a frog coin in it. Uh, but I think that's everything in here, so let's talk to the blue toad shop. Mario, good to have a customer at last. What do you need? Okay. You got a basic selection of items here pretty good. The pink toad, though, sells equipment for us. Hello, Mario. It's so nice of you to drop by the shop. What can I do for you? And now we can buy the thick pants, which is a padded shirt. No, shirt. <laughs> ah, I know what I'm saying. Shirts for Mario, pants for Mallow, so we can get some extra better armor. There's also the jump, choose, antidote pin, wake up pin, 
true form pin and the fearless pin, which prevents fear attacks. So we probably want to buy that, since that's pretty good. But it's so nice that we can actually buy all these pins here, if we want to. I would say... <laughs> I'm tempted to buy an extra one, but I also think only you... You only really need one of any accessory. So... And you don't even need to have extra... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but anyway, we can equip the stuff right here, so let's do that. And I think I'm gonna give... Mario the Fearless Pin for the moment. And I might give Mallow the True Form Pin. So he can't get transformed. Uh, but anyway, so we can equip from here, but we can also sell... ...our stuff from here, so we don't need the pants in the shirt anymore. Since they've been outclassed already. There is a limited space of how much you can hold in your equipment screen, so you probably want to not fill that up with item, like, weapons and armor, basically. There's, there's, there's usually, uh, there's, there's no extra, um, like, uh, accessories that you don't, would be worth throwing away, so. The only thing's worth throwing away or selling, at least, is, like, old weapons and also old armor. We can also get rid of the hammer because I don't think we're going to need that anymore as well. There is some, like, not all weapons can be rebought if they're special weapons. Uh, but the hammer is one of the items that we can't, or weapons that we can buy later on as well, so we don't need to worry about it too much. Uh, but anyway, let's keep moving. Exploring the town. Let's have a look at this house up here. My husband still hasn't come back. I wonder what's keeping him. Ooh. Ooh, it's, it's probably fine. Anyway, let's go behind this house, though, and talk to this toad back here. I can't do a lot right now, so let me ask you this. Have you seen the mushrooms in the forest? Uh, no, never. There are two kinds of mushrooms. One terrorizes people and the other helps people. Avoid the former. Good to know. Ah, uh, but anyway, let's go to the topmost house over here now. There's a stairway that leads to my house, but my son's been playing with the controls again. Mario, you're the only... you could... Only you could jump up there. Please, help me get back up to my house. Well, I can jump off of you to get up here, so that helps. I don't think there's anything else back here that we need to worry about. Actually, maybe there is. Found me, huh? What are you doing? Walking around here, though. You must be pretty bored. <laughs> I love the... the characters behind the houses. Uh, but anyway, uh... I think I need to save state here. So let's do that. And let's not grab the items here. Hello. What's taking daddy so long? Do you think he's still looking for the treasure? What treasure? Let's hit the switch though. And let's go outside. Uh, also, I believe there's also a hidden block somewhere around here. Hang on. Above the bed. Right there. Cool. You can also, like, still touch hidden blocks when you're jumping into them. So if you're suddenly jumping around and you get... You're unable to move forward in midair, that means that there's a hidden block there, if that helps find them. Uh, but anyway... Thanks a million, Mario. Say, were my treasures okay? Uh, 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 there's, there's several options here. They sure were. Oh, that's great news. What a relief. Since we get to get hit by any arrows, I'll tell you a secret. Enter the forest when you hit an area with four paths. Go left, left, straight, right. In that order. You'll surely find something nice. So there we go. Enter the forest. When you, yeah, you said that already. But we can now grab those, I guess. Also, that's a, those are coin blocks. What did I do? What have I done? I've ruined everything. It's fine. It's all fine. Uh, anyway. Gonna reload my save state now. Gonna take these, which are actually different earlier, because they were actually flowers. Uh, but anyway, grab that again. For a frog coin. Activate that. And now if we go out here... Thanks a million, Mario. Say, were my treasures okay? Ah, uh, they sure were! Oh, that's great news. What a relief.
He'll never know. What? They're gone, Murray. You're the only one who can reach them. Uh, sorry, I got carried away. Oh well. Since we didn't get hit by any arrows, I'll tell you a secret. So he tells us that again. Uh, but anyway, let me. Oh, you're gonna just say the same same thing again. Let me reload the save state again. This is this is gonna get a little bit repetitive, possibly, with me doing this a whole bunch. But that's okay. Why does that block feel like it's in a weird spot? I don't know. Uh, but anyway. Are my treasures okay? Uh, I wouldn't say so. You're kidding! What? They're gone, Mario! You're the only one who can reach them! Uh, I don't know anything. Alright, I'll take your word. <laughs> and so he wouldn't tell us the, the secret. Uh, unless we actually talk to him again and say we sorry we got carried away. So yeah, we, we will need to know that hint that he gives us, sir. But yeah, it's probably better to get it before you get, let him into the house so you can get the flowers, though. Uh, but anyway, we can also jump on top of these blocks, but there's nothing up here, I believe, sir. Okay. Let's keep moving. That was a lot of stuff all at once. Uh, but I think I want to talk to this toad over here now. Since the day a shooting star fell into the forest, arrows have been showering our town. I... I can't move. And here's the inn over here, so... Mario, help! Mwahaha! <laughs> hey, Mario, I'll be... I'll be taking care of the... of Princess Toadstool now. Boing boing! Super jump attack! Gwaha! <laughs> you think you can't... you can hurt me with your childish pranks? Attention, Toaster, you're coming with me. Zip your lip. Help! Help! Somebody, help, please help me! Help! Oh my gosh! It's a. It's ma. Ma. Mom! Mom, look, we have a guest! Yes, dear, I hear you. Hello, the. Uh, why? Aren't you Mario? For real? Well, you have the hat and the funky mustache well, and the funky stash. Are you really Mario? <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. <sighs> Gonna save state again because this is worth it. Uh, you betcha. How do I know it's you? You might just be pulling my leg. Show me. Prove it. Okay, I jump, I guess. All right. Hey Mario, you, you want want to play with me? I'm playing Save the World. Ah, uh, well, hang on, I need to go back a second. Because it's interesting that if you say wrong number... Aw, oh, you're, fa you're fake. Well, you'll have to do. Let's play my Geno game. And we won't have to actually prove it, so it's probably better to say no just to make it things go by faster. Now, Gaz, Mario might be a little tired, dear. Aw, oh, come on, Mom. You, you never play with me. It's no fun playing alone. Oh dear, Mario, I hate to s ask, but could you play with Gaz for a, l for a little while? Yes, Mario! Just bought, uh, bought the farm, so, um... You can be Bowser. <laughs> I'll be Gino, okay? Ready? Let's play from where I left off. All set? Oh, scary. But just watch me. Better watch out, Bowser, because cause Gino is going to blow you away. Take this. Your turn, Bowser. Ow. Oh, no. If he keeps this up, I'm finished. All right. You asked for it. The super duper custom pa patented one and only shooting sh star shot. Oops, I, uh, I think I missed. Oh dear, oh my, Mario, are you alright?
Well, I guess it's time to get up. What a rough night. Anyway, let's save. And I think that is, uh, well, hang on. I'll, I'll, I'll give it another second. Uh, well, we've stayed in the inn at least, so that's good for us. Uh, but let's go downstairs. Mom, you'll never believe what I just saw! It was amazing, Mom! I just saw Gino walk into the forest! Neat, huh? Yes, dear, that's nice, dear. Is it, and isn't Gino the one who broke my lamp the other day? Aw, oh, Ma! That was just, well, you know... Now this was real! I swear, Mum, really, it's true, I saw him outside! Alright, Gaz, let's hear it. What a, what are you trying to get out of- out of this time, hmm? Mum, I didn't do anything! I really, truly saw Gino walking into the forest! So, sorry if I hurt you, but... What would Gino want in the forest? Oh, this boy is impossible. But there we go. I think that's everything to do in this town, so... I guess we can leave. But that is it for now, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.